Well, I think we're officially at the final boss now. Okay, there we are. So there's actually a bunch of used serpents. Okay. Well, I guess we have an actual boss fight now. Uh oh. That's a good line. <laughs> Of course you're calling ads. That's what any uncreative boss would do, just call ads. Any cheap, low-budget... What the frick? Boss. I, li I like how she gets scooped up when she takes damage, just like in Mario Sunshine. Round out is actually pretty effective. Phobic. Well, that's a new word. How do you know what it's supposed to reference? Ouch. Oh, now you got the stronger enemies out. Of course you do.
Oh, oh, that was easy. I saw this. I saw the saving icon, so we won the fight. So it just took a few more extra hits. Okay, I don't know what was happening there. I'm so happy, I can finally die. <laughs> no, I don't want to lose my shadow friend. Aww, oh, it's a song. It really does remind me of the ending scene of Wind Waker. <laughs> the boats were bouncing still. <laughs> Poor mayor. What's the matter with her neighbor? Easy, Doris. Nothing's wrong with her. I just thought it rude to leave an old lady in distress. I have a feeling that particular lady knows how to take care of herself. We did it, no, we spark and did it. <laughs> Whoa, look at these weights. Solid stuff. I've never walked on ground that wasn't rock or sand. You did well, all of you, eventually. And without you, my dear girl, we never would have made it. I saw right away that she was made of the right stuff. And we never found your medication. No there ever was. Isn't she, Doris? <sighs> Sigrid, you've done such... <sighs> Why can't I just do this? Grandma, I... No, I have to do this. <sighs> when Iris was a kid, John always took care of the mushy stuff. But when he wasn't around anymore and we lost Iris, when it was just you and me, I didn't know how to handle my own feelings, much less yours. I put a roof over your head, fried some herring for dinner, and wiped your nose. But the rest, I just couldn't... I... I'm so sorry, Shrimpy. You didn't only feed me. You taught me how to use our that smirk just looks so forced and sarcastic. I don't know. I don't know what that expression is supposed to be. It just looks like you're forcing. You're forcing emotional sentiment out of yourself. Yeah. Yeah. Sounds nice. So, what do we do now, now, now that we won? It's like you're saying, this uh, thank you, Grandma. Like this chance. means so much to me. <laughs> right. This is where the real work begins. 
begins. We have ground to walk upon, but we need to learn how to cultivate it without depleting it. The rifts are sealed, but we still have to get rid of the rest of that wretched gloom. How long will it take to fix this? When will everything be back to normal? There's no fixed, dear. And I don't think any one of us knows what normal is anymore. It's a lifetime's work. What we end up with, only time can tell. As long as no new fools come around and start ruining things, I'm sure we can keep things in order. Untie me, you wretched cretin. I demand to be released. I'm afraid I can't do that, sir, but if you just allow me to... Word from Candle Hill. Seems the plants are growing there, too. Apparently, a big stem of some kind has pierced right through the canteen. Get some rest, folks. Then we have work to do. This was an alright game. Had a nice chill vibe. The, the the movement was nice and fluid. Not really, not really the best. That it was kind of awkward at times. But the, the bouncing, yeah, all the care, all the characters were nice. Uh, we didn't really, there's at least two quests we didn't do, and a handful of characters we didn't find, so shame that. Sebastian Strand. Okay, so that's who we named the setting after. But what really made this game worth it were the bouncing boats. I will never forget them. Music was also pretty good, pretty solid. Sigrid was overall a nice character. I liked her voice. I do think the mayor, like being given the villain role that he that he had, it was kind of stupid. <laughs> All right, well now I'm just gonna skip past the credits, since we just got, or since we're done with the beautiful part now. <laughs> You're welcome. Yay! Free play mode. Yay! Yay! Oh, it's his boat. Now he's got a bouncing boat. Oh, and it keels over. <laughs> How much can we actually buy, though? Shiny crown. Well, I guess that's a reward for beating the main story, so I guess I'll keep that on. Whistlers. 
names. It feels odd seeing the dirty paws of actual people with faces and names and swapping my mind around everything. I feel so ashamed of everything we put them through, but shame won't change anything. We need to figure out how to move forward now that the truth is out. Moria Oshia, known as the Terry Pauls by some, currently known as the Wizards. Moria is their leader. Apparently, there is a lot of talk about her during the war. She came the face of the enemy. We'll update the mayor's page. Not really. Yeah, probably a handful of notes we missed. I'm invited to a wedding. I'm not sure how they work, but I'll figure it out. I'm sure Mrs. Starlight can give you some advice on what to wear for the occasion. Nah, you can just go without the shoes, though. I'll keep these here and wear them once I get my ears pierced. So pretty. Now, don't get your ears pierced. Just leave your ears as they are. They're, don't ruin them. We never did find Clara. It would be nice if we had a fast travel. Or do we have a fast travel? Where am I? Okay, so I think I'm in the center. I can't tell which direction I'm going. It does feel like I'm going in the plaza's direction. something. Is up here. Uh, it's just you again. Asta's mini games were fun, except for that last one.
this is something we already did, clearly. Almost at the plaza, sole chance we can find Clara. Oh, the mayor's back. Yay. We let him go. Now he's just chilling here. Oh, there's some blue we forgot to clean up. I have no idea where to find Clara. I think we found her. At least I hope this is Clara. There we are. Ew, what an awful taste. Thank you, that was horrible, but at least I still have a pulse, I think. I was on my way to see Mrs. Bain. I helped her with her heart condition to the best of my ability. I was a chemist once, but the war forced me into a career change. I might know you haven't seen my stethoscope, have you? I'm sure I had it on me before that glop sees me. I suppose I can go look for it, but with those rumors of a sea monster in the area, it just feels more foolish and usual to go for a swim. Uh... Oh my god, are you serious? Ugh. I mean, I already combed... I already combed this whole archipelago. Now you expect me to find a stupid thing. Clara Arrow. Living in the remains of an old laboratory, making medicines. What are grades that could be found? She revealed that she had a crush on Iris. My mom. I wonder if mom ever had feelings for her, too. Nothing as sad as unrequited love, they say, but I'm not sure. Isn't there always a worth in feeling love for someone? I mean, well, your mom obviously got with a man. That's how she had you. Am I gonna find a stethoscope? I have, have to climb all these islands again just to try. Again, that was just another example of Secret Shadow just talking to other people's shadows.
I'm just gonna assume the sense because it's not up there. I mean, could it be on one of the central islands? That is sense code from now on. I'm just padding out at this point. But yeah, great game overall. <laughs> 